So in this video, we're going to factor 2x squared plus 5x minus 42. It's a chino meal, y'all. Okay, anyways, so we're going to start with our parentheses, because we're going to be multiplying, because it's factoring. And we're going to see we have a 2x here, so we're going to have a 2x in one, and just an x in the other. And since there's a negative there, but a positive there, you know that one of them is going to be negative, and one of them is going to be positive. And if this is wrong, we can just change it later. It'll be pretty easy. And what we should do next is list the factors of 42. So 1 times 42, and there's 2 times 21, and there's 3 times uh, 14, and then there's six times seven and those are the only factors and so we can start you can try any one of those so it's pretty much trial and error at this point so it's obviously not going to be that one because the number you would get after you do this would be either way too big or way too small and it's pretty much the same with this one and this one you could try like that negative 14 and 6, and that would give you negative 8. And if you were to flip them, you would get positive 8, so you know it can't be that. And so the only thing left to try is 6 and 7. Since the positive one is going to be in the middle, the bigger number should be, well, the negative is going to be on this side. Then you can try. 7 and 6 and see if that works and you get negative 6 plus 14 and that, yeah that gives you 8 yeah that gives you 8 and then you can try the other way around and that gives you a positive 5 so this is the answer if you're trying to factor that. Um, negative 14 and 6, and that would give you negative 8. And if you were to flip them, you would get positive 8, so you know it can't be that. And so the only thing left to try is 6 and 7. Since the positive one is going to be in the middle, the bigger number should be, well, the negative is going to be on this side. Then you can try 7 and 6 and see if that works and you get negative 6 plus 14 and that, yeah that gives you 8 yeah that gives you 8 and then you can try the other way around that gives you a positive 5. So this is the answer if you're trying to factor that. Yeah.